Welcome back. Oh my goodness. Could it possibly be a shrine? When's the last time we see, we've seen a shrine? Welcome back to a new uh, to another Bill Legend video, fellas. It's been a while since we've seen a shrine. So it's the gunslinger that is the boss. I think it's actually that guy right over there. We're full health, so we're going to leave the shrine. Oh, wow, I'm surprised. I really thought I was going to be able to hook that corner, but we were not. So um, I believe it's the gun guy, as the name suggests is the boss for today and uh, let's see how it goes so I, I mentioned before that these enemies are actually quite difficult they're very high damage he has an attack all skill they either have um, pretty strong single single target damage skills like that um, so we're gonna be on our toes if I am correct and that is the boss that I was seeing um, and we got a health shrine there. I'm really confident about this flag. But we'll see how it goes. I do see a healing skill. Was that the guy with the bomb doing the heal? I think it was. I think it was. Which is good and bad. It's good because if he's healing, then he's not killing me. However, um, it's going to be a pain in the butt also. Who was the boss on the last fight that we just did? I literally just forgot. I'm going to use the SP to heal, so obviously, yes, the bomb guy is healing. I always forgot who the boss was on the last one. All right, well, whatever. We'll figure it out. Because I'm wondering who's gonna be the boss in the next one. That's gotta be him, right? Nope, he's the same, he's the same, I was wrong, I was wrong. Well, let's see if we can hook this corner. No, no luck at all, okay. Interesting map. Um, in the raids, I actually don't think they're using random maps. I think what they're doing is they're making a couple maps, and then they are um, just just having them selected randomly, but not the maps being generated randomly. Um, at least that's what I think. That could be wrong, but I know I've been. It's like you, if you run enough raids, you're like, I guarantee I've seen this exact same map again, multiple times. But who knows? Could be wrong. It could just be. You know, you're losing those brain cells late at night. And, uh, you know, we, we all get a little crazy after doing a couple hundred raids. Speaking of a couple hundred raids, um, my next push is going to be doing gold. And I'm going to get, I'm going to farm up enough gold to have it saved away an, again to craft Thunder Fury, to plus 10 refine every slot, and to do a ton of reforging to get the stats that I want. So that's going to be a ton. I'm probably going to keep going and get a bunch of gold. There's the boss right there. So I was wrong and right at the same time. Um, I'm probably going to get enough gold so I can do some minions. I just want to do all my gold farming and just kind, of, kind of be done with worrying about it. So that'll be the next push. I didn't click that. Maybe I did. Um, we're not going to be able to dodge this guy. But I do have the health shrine, so I guess I could try to use that. So yeah, gold will be done, and then after that, I'll do my uh, raid push as well. I'm planning a big, big raid push. I finally got time for it, and uh, my team is obviously big and beefy. They've been strong enough for a while, but the the stronger your team is, the faster they can run, which means the more raids that you can get in. I'm very curious how many raids I could do overnight if I let it just go for eight hours nonstop. Um, that would be very curious. I probably won't have that many resources anyways, but um, I think it's pretty cool. I think it would be the way to go. Oh, we're taking a lot of damage there, boys. Hopefully he doesn't die so I can get a heal off. Hmm. I'm gonna do a heal there, and then hopefully my tank can do a heal. No, it didn't work out that way. Of course my tank didn't get a chance. No, he did. He's there. Look at that. All right, so we still have some, some uh, SP. We're still relatively strong. I think we're in a good spot to fight this boss. I'm not going to go all the way back. Actually, if there's nobody in the way, I'll go hit the shrine. There's nobody in the way, so I'll go hit the shrine. If there was one enemy in the way, I wouldn't risk. it wouldn't be, would not be worth risking it. So bang, here's boss. 
Gurgle, gurgle, lurgle. What the? Gurgle, gurgle. I can dig it. Kind of like Murloc speak. I'm down. I speak Murloc. All right, boys. Reflex are already coming in big. Very, very good. I want to take out the bomb guy because he can heal. And uh, now we're just pressing buttons. So easy peasy. We're going to throw it on autopilot. I'm going to drink some of this water so I can keep talking. Oh, we're staying hydrated over here, boys. Make it happen. It's a race against the clock. He could actually wipe out my team and that would be really bad. That would be really, really bad. But, nope, we get it. And there you go. That's a wrap. Not too bad. Um, I do think the amount of total stats the enemies will have in the next one will probably be um, high enough to be a little bit difficult. But, all right, boys. Uh, with that, we're going we're gonna to wrap it up, as always. Oh, that's such a cool map with the, with the drawings in the background. But, anyways, as always, appreciate you guys watching, and I'll see you in the next video.